Hey, my name is uh, Reverend Carl Johnson. I am what I call an ecosystem designer. And that means that we do a whole uh, holistic approach towards end of food insecurity through faith, food, and culture. And so how we do that is through our worker-owned co-op grocery store uh, that has a coffee shop. And also uh, we have a church uh, that's uh, locally uh, missional. And we have uh, our workforce development program that we reach uh, youth between 18 and 32 and teach them transferable skills and uh, basic kitchen skills so they can not only get jobs but also start their own business and move towards uh, a process of wealth building. We do that all in one building under one name which is the GW Carver Cultural Center for Innovation. And so our heart is to take basic needs and innovate uh, within our community. And so we are super excited. We are involved in community development, human flourishing, and church planting. So it's a, it's a, it's a really fun, uh, energetic, active life that we live here as we get to engage people from all different walks of life. So first, uh, the store and the church are actually within the same vision. We wanted to bring the redemptive plan of, of Jesus to, to be able to build community and discipleship through access to food. So if you had to wake up every day and ask how I'm gonna feed my kids, how I'm gonna to get to work, how I'm gonna get a job, how I'm gonna pay my bills, and how I'm gonna get my medication, before you, people were asking these questions when they woke up every morning. And we said, what is the one barrier that we can remove as a church so they could get faster, get, get into the question of like, who is Jesus in my life? And so that's where food insecurity came into a play. Uh, we started to see that those questions around food insecurity and those questions around the gospel started to become synonymous. And so what we decided to do was call every church a grocery store. And so we created this model of where we would create a missional community that would be infused within a local business, which is a grocery store, to be able to reach and disciple people through access to food. And so churches are built around fellowship and food. And so we knew that wouldn't be a no brainer, but also what would happen if we went into an impoverished neighborhood where tithing wouldn't be good, but we know people would buy food. And so that's where the grocery store came to play as being a sustainable option for our church to be able to continue to do the work within the community. And, it, and so far it has worked really well. Our house grocers and coffee you will find us on the corner of 7th and hope in dayton's bluff and our address is 781 7th street we're open tuesday through saturday for great coffee great conversation and sustainable life